Have you ever wondered what it might be like if you decided to take your solo esthetician business online offering your clients virtual services? Well, if you are, in today's video, I am going to go into more detail about becoming a virtual esthetician. But before I do, hey, welcome back to SBE Aesthetics. I'm your licensed esthetician, professional makeup artist, and here on this channel, I cover topics about being an esthetician, an entrepreneur, a skincare and beauty enthusiast, which benefits you to become a better you, you guys. So let's dig into this juicy information you may want to know more about, okay? So the first thing you want to do is get your esthetician license. And I'll leave related videos down in the description below for you to learn more about how to do so. Next, I will start creating content related to what I am going to be offering online. So that would be like me creating a social media post on Facebook and Instagram, letting my clients know what I'm going to be getting ready to offer while also leaving small mini videos of me performing the classes I'm going to be offering. This helps me build engagement and anticipation. So you want to do these things to get your clients ready for you to be offering these new services that you're going to be offering online. For example, I started offering makeup classes and plan to add skincare classes as well. I also offer virtual skin consultations. So this is where I would ask my clients about their skincare needs and desires. I would get all my forms, my skincare forms together. This is something I I am currently in the process of working on trying to figure out what exactly are the questions I would like to ask pre and post and how I want to type up my report for my clients in regards to their skincare routine. I will also clean up all my social media pages so I will take away any photos or videos that do not resonate with my business idea or model okay. This goes for both my business and personal Facebook page okay. Why would I do this? This will help streamline all of my social media accounts making them all look the same, okay? And have the same feel, which will help bring trustworthiness organization and professionalism you guys to your business or to my business <laughs> i will also make sure i have a way to contact clients either by email booking site or a website so that they can reach me and get in touch about bookings or have any questions so your virtual imagery and content are necessary so i would suggest going live every week or every two weeks about what you're going to be offering okay i will also suggest to you that you start a youtube channel Channel to better help you build an audience that is interested in what you have to offer. Being a virtual esthetician requires you to be active on social media where you should stay relevant, <laughs> okay? I found that videos on Facebook and Instagram do really well, as well as photos with rich content or stories about yourself, okay? So if you do decide to do a photo, you wanna make sure that you are providing rich content. And what I mean by rich content, I mean like it has to benefit the person who's reading what, whatever you're describing the picture is about. Okay, so if you don't do a video, make sure you provide rich content in your photos so it can be more engaging for your client or for your future clients. <laughs> if you've been working as a solo esthetician or an esthetician and are thinking about taking it to the next level by going virtual, I challenge you. I challenge you to do so. It may be tough, but as long as you stay consistent and believe in yourself and pick an effective routine that you do every day, you'll be successful. Mark my word, you'll be successful because I believe you will achieve being a virtual esthetician. If you're already doing it physically, you could do it virtually. Now, Virtually is challenging because people automatically assume, well, I'm not touching them. How can I help them with their skincare? And I'm not being proactive. Well, you are being active. You're being active by sharing what they can do to get those results and, and then some, okay? So don't look too hard into it, but you can do it, okay? So please be sure to like, comment, and share my video, you guys. I really, really, really appreciate you all for subscribing and becoming a part of my family, okay? Catch you guys later. Bye.